How's it going everyone? Today's topic is K1 Communion Master Law Sector. Champions are Barrier and Overload with a threat of Solar. To find this Law Sector, you're going to go to the Moon, find it on your waypoint, locate here to Sanctuary, and then make your way over. If you've never ran this before, you're going to run right through here. You have to go down this pathway, run it on normal. Once you complete it on normal, you can come back to the flag. Once you get on the flag, you can run it on Legend or Master. Legend will have less champions, Master will have more champions. Whatever, uh, whatever option you like to do, um, you know, pick your preference. If you're good at champions, go master, increase your chance of even exotic anyways. Um, so you're trying to find those exotic pieces for the day, then definitely run that on master. Our build's gonna consist of arcs, gathering, sorry, gathering storm here for massive damage for each champion whenever it's available, as it'll be up all the time. Gambler's dodge, which would pair up with combination blow and our lethal current to do our jolts. Flow state will keep us amplified. Our grenade spam will be skip grenade going with our shinobu's val exotic armor piece our grenades are going to pair up very nicely with ions moronic traces amplified for more or amplitude sorry for more uh, orbs of power uh, resistance to keep us alive 25 percent damage reduction and then spark a shock to help jolt also so we can jolt here we can jolt here um so make sure we just do dodge melee which will jolt and then grenades will jolt all day long as you can spam those out Builds are going to consist of, uh, ashes, you bet, killing can consist of, sorry, ashes to assets or grenade, kick grenade kickstart here to help us with our grenade spam as you'll be doing uh, grenades all day long. As long as they're doing damage, they'll be doing, you know, you'll, you'll have more grenades uptime. I'd recommend for your chest piece here, you run two arc, one void, or maybe one solar, depending on the threat. Definitely run two arc as the arc threat is definitely uh, very apparent. Everything else here for is uh, kind of standard, but we run for every, or, uh, every hunter, um, build because it just helps keep us alive give us more grenades uh rotates everything around because we will be using our grenade a lot uh, so this will help us out a lot stats are focused on 100 resilience 100 discipline throw everything else into intellect or recovery if you like i'd probably recommend intellect because we like to have our uh, super up all the time as it does a lot of damage artifacts fully set up for um arc make sure you have anti-barrier for auto rifle if you're using uh trace rifle or scout rifle make sure it's activated here so you can take care of the champions our weapons will consist of a shotgun here to help do a lot of damage as we don't need anything else to help with jolts as we're going to use our thunderlord to help with jolts along with everything else in our kit to do jolts um, and massive damage and then our any auto rifle you can put in either slot shotgun whatever you want to do in these slots um just uh one any auto rifle will help you with anti-barrier i just happen to have dark decider from the iron banner which gives me vault shot which is always a nice other benefit to do ton tons of damage and um to jolt targets so this should be a quick run here should be about probably five six minutes but shouldn't be that bad. If you have any questions or recommendations, and put them in the comments below. We'll see what exotic weapon or armor piece you want to see. As always, I'm getting a subscriber almost every day, so I appreciate all the support. You guys are doing amazing. Keep it up. Um, I'll keep making these guides. All right, start this off here. Make it simple for us. Up over the edge, and don't ruin your flawless by falling over in the crevasse. All right, just immediately take care of the overload. this guy out real fast here once he's low enough we'll use our finisher and then throw our grenades all day long boom anti-barrier perfect this will take out everything else awesome now we're good to go grenade as much as we need okay find everything far here you, you have your you can use your heavy if you want. Doesn't matter, whatever you want to do with it. Or rehab your grenades, throw them as much as you can. Throw them all over the place. What we're gonna do is get up here, dodge, and then punch. Should be able to get ourselves some health back as long as we're punching. Do as much damage as we can. yourself alive. No reason to do anything risky here. Punch, punch, punch. That'll keep you healthy. Now what we need to do is just find the barrier here. Make it into a unicorn. And then we're good. Perfect. Now it should die soon. We're just punching it to heal ourselves. Everything else that comes close to it will die also, so we're not really worried.
Okay, we're gonna do our anti-barrier. Then we're just we can punch, 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 grenade what we want, whatever you want to do. Perfect. Now we just gotta finish everything else off. You wanna grab this so I can overload overflow my mag. There we are, now we're in a good spot. So what we wanna do is we wanna rush in here, use our grenade as much as we can to take out the overloads. There's gonna be two of them here. If you're ever low, you can always punch, 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 and you'll survive. I'm gonna get over here and punch, 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 so I can make sure I don't die or anything. Perfect. Grenades, all we want. Punch, 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 punch. And picking up orbs will take care of four also. Perfect. Now we got our staff again. We can use it. Uh, I'm probably gonna recommend using it here early. If I can find the. Uh, there it is. Just take out everything here. I'm gonna worry about it. It'll finish off the overload for us. Look at the unicorn. Now we're gonna have one more overload. We're gonna take care of him up top. We have our heavy for this one. You don't want to use your heavy you can always just punch 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 take care of jolts and it'll work also punch 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 got everything here make sure you have your minor spec on for your auto rifle so it does more damage to red bars so use your ever use your heavy or your shotgun for everything else waiting for the boss to spawn. We're going to reload all our weapons. Perfect. we we'll just throw grenades all day long at the boss. Whenever you run out of grenades, then you can uh, go and move on to the next section or find some orbs on the ground. Uh, there should be able to should be able to use your auto rifle to take out any barrier stuff. And then I'm gonna go ahead and punch this guy just to. Oh, he got healed. Where are you at, unicorn? Perfect. There we are. Take out the barrier so he doesn't heal. He should die to that. If not, we have our anti barrier. Perfect. Now he's got a fine boss. Once we have a boss, boss will either jump off the edge, because he does that sometimes, or we'll just keep throwing grenades at him until he dies. Punch, punch, punch. Remember, punches still heal you. Some grenades, we're spamming as much as we want. We have heavy for boss if we wanted. Again, we can use anything we need. Plenty of orbs. Arc Siphon will give us all the... Uh, all the orbs we want to keep our grenade kickstart active. See if we can get this guy to use his barrier. Focus the sky with barrier and grenade, and we can just be able to fin either finish it with an execution or um, melee it. Either one works. Now we have all our ammo can be used for the boss. Make sure your grenade span. Don't forget to do that. Ooh, I think I'm a unicorn. Oh, I miss. I missed, but still, it's still okay. Still got everything else. Now that everything's dead, you can. Uh, you don't have to worry about all these red bars. You can use your heavy as much as you want, whatever. You won't be able to get out of here until you kill all the uh, mobs, but if you want to go and stop the clock, you can. To guarantee you're flawless by just uh, grabbing the loot right there. Let's go and finish this off here. Lights are open. That means the door's going to open for us. 
There we are. So we can just stop the clock. Move on. Seven minute run on the dot. Sweet. If you have any recommendations for uh, exotic weapons or armor, let me know in the comments below. Uh, as always, like and subscribe, and uh, hope you have a fantastic day.